Hi guys, back again with another reaction, new episode of How to Get Away with Murder. I literally just got back from uni and I was like, I need to watch this episode because I've been trying to avoid spoilers all morning. I hope you enjoyed the video and let's go. There's a pulse, I repeat, we have a pulse. Oh dear. He's keeping you under arrest. You have the right to remain silent, anything you say. Ci dobbiamo calmare un attimo, eh? Ci dobbiamo calmare. I need two large bore IVs, our fluids at 150. Oh my god, this is so stressful. No, no, non ce la faccio, non ce la faccio. Now it's gonna go back in time. Yeah, exactly. And we're never gonna know. partner a long time ago and my friend here is actually my girlfriend <laughs> lesbian heisman that's good we haven't seen that one in a while just to be clear you are or are not gay i'm gay she's it's complicated awesome <laughs> we do complicated for a living Okay. <laughs> I don't know who are like more between like Annalise and Nate or Annalise and Nevi. They'll enjoy punishing you in public too much. Better just make a statement in private. Promise to go to anger management classes. I'll probably hit people there too. I really <laughs> need to retire. The same insurance money is that good? So what you do with the insurance money? I hired a hitman to kill Frank. Are we really doing this? Oh, I knew it! Oh my god. It crossed, it seriously crossed my mind. Nate, hi. <laughs> I didn't know you were in town. Yeah, I'm at this conference for a few days. Came over to help with the whole suspension mess. Right. Did you find out anything? Talk to Adwood. I don't think she's behind it. You sleeping with Eve? Uh -huh. Would it bother you if I were? Screw who you want. We don't have me living up in That's here. That's your choice, my man. Because you thought Frank was going to put a bullet so in me. So get out. I'm an alcoholic. here to make excuses or to ask for forgiveness oh my god how long i've been wanting this to happen i shit them so much She's the one I was talking to on the phone the other night. We met a few months ago during. It's gonna melt your lungs from inside out. And it's gonna hurt real bad. Like the worst pain of your life. And still, it won't make up for what you did to her. Enjoy hell, Bob. blood gases. Uh, Dr. Lowell? ET tube looks good. Dr. Lowell. What? I'm the med student. I was sent to get the lab results. Get to the point. She's pregnant. She? Oh my god. Oh my god. I know her. Oh 
mio dio ok guys I, I, oh my god ok so many things happen ok oh, so we know oh my god I, I, ok first of all I wasn't expecting oh, <laughs> oh my god this show it's too much we know that there are two bodies well there's one dead body and there's Laurel who survived the fire and she's pregnant she's freaking pregnant I really I'm really sorry for Annalise because now uh, she kind of uh, broke up with Nate and uh, Eve found someone else and but at the same time I feel like it's not fair on Nate because after all he's been through like Annalise put him through Nate is a good guy he's just trying to help her and, in, and then Annalise just fucks everything up you know but at the same time I really like Annalise and Eve, and Eve together I don't know what to think because this show is just too much to handle every single episode that airs it's just <laughs> like I, I, now I have stuff to do I need to get on with my uni work and I have to do things and now I can't because after this episode I just need to lay in bed and just think about life and how to get over murder and who freaking died <laughs> so yeah I really loved this episode um, yeah just comment below and let me know what you thought about it thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time bye